All right, what it do, YouTube? It's your boy, Rich Eats. I'm out here in Hollywood right now. Actually, like the Fairfax Shopping District. And we about to get out here and find us some food, people. One spot I gotta go try out, delicious pizza. Haven't had that in a long time, and this is a great spot, so I gotta put y'all up on that. And then we gonna go find something else after that, people. So, back in Cali right now. Getting some shit, you know, settled in Houston. Getting all my stuff settled. And... We're going to have a whole new adventure for 2021, people. So stay with me. Thanks for watching. Thanks for subscribing. And let's keep it going, people. So let's get out here. We made it here in front of Delicious Pizza. Now I'm telling you, this spot is fire. It's fire, people. I had it before, but I gotta do it again for the YouTube, you know, and give them another score. I forgot what I gave them last time, so we're gonna we're gonna just call this all new now. So let's go in here, people. Let's check it out. perfection like I like it. I like it a little darker under there, but see that? Nice and thin. Crisp to it. No flop. Let's go. Top, you can taste that authentic sauce they use using good stuff yep i tell you that real cheese real everything this is all fresh ingredients i promise you people so that was delicious pizza which it was delicious I promise you I believe now after eating it I kind of got my memory back right 
motorcycles, of course. But anyway, I got my memory back right. And I remember I scored it like a 9-1 or a 9-2 or something like that. This one wasn't as good as the last one. So I can honestly say it wasn't cooked to perfection on the bottom like I like usually like like the crust a little bit darker but I'm gonna do it like this this time 8.9 people for delicious pizza now it is fire but that's an official score now that's what I'm giving them this is going down in my record book forever so all right anyway people I don't know if that's over yet let's see if we can find something else So, I think it's about time we head back to the other side of town, go grab the car, cause I'm pretty much tired of walking around, looking for things, knowing I'm not gonna find anything over here. So, yeah, let's go get the car, people, and find us something else. Y'all ready? Let's go. All right, people, and just like that, we in the car back in Long Beach. So, let's go over here. And I thought of something, like I saw I was driving by another Burger King on my way here and I saw they got a chicken sandwich and I haven't had any chicken sandwiches from Burger King ever. So let's go see what this talking about people. It's about time we go hit up Burger King. So let's do this. Through, and we got our Burger King right here. So, anyway, now if you see on the drive through menu, they made it look just like the Popeyes burger, like so it's the same colors as Popeyes, the orange background. But they already lost points off the top. As soon as I saw the burger, I had to have it custom made because it comes with tomatoes, uh, lettuce onions I think all that shit and that's not for a chicken sandwich chicken sandwich does not need tomatoes on it like that's the worst thing you could do to a chicken sandwich is put tomatoes on it you know I give you a pass with the lettuce but tomatoes come on now 
I don't too much even like ketchup with my chicken. So anyway, I got it just the buns, pickles, basically like a real chicken sandwich. Let's see here. Alright people, let's get into this real fast. Here we go. down to the last bite that's a pretty damn good chicken sandwich I won't lie there you go all right people so um, as far as this burger or I mean chicken sandwich goes it's pretty good it's fire it's not one of the best you know don't get me wrong it's better than KFC so for sure they jumped over to KFC. Burger King, way better than KFC's chicken sandwich. But anyway, um, I did have to order it, uh, well, custom order it. So I had them take off the tomatoes and the lettuce. And I just told them keep mayonnaise, pickles, you know. And then Burger King, one thing about their pickles, they're not like the pickles that you would get at Popeyes or like a, um, a Dave's Hot Chicken or something. It's like they're more, they're the same type of pickles you get in the burger, so they're a little extra sour. I didn't like that about the pickles that Burger King have, but mind you, I love Burger King pickles. Some of the best pickles. I just don't like them with this sandwich, so, you know, they need to go more with the cucumber style um, pickles, but other than that, it was pretty good. Not the best. So what I'm gonna hit them with for today's chicken sandwich, I'm gonna hit them with a 6-3. That's what they get for their chicken sandwich, a 6-3. It was pretty good. Very typical. Not thick and juicy like Popeyes or Chick-fil-A, nothing like that. So yeah, that's that people. But right now, this is a new year. Well, coming up. It'll be a new year, probably by the time I put this out or by the time you see this, we'll be in 2021. And hopefully all this bull crap will be over and we can get back to normal life, people. So I got a lot of stuff coming up too. Uh, I just came back to Cali real fast. I got to do something out here. So I said, hey, let me get in some footage while I'm out here. Got some real quick and I'll be going back to Texas. So all my subscribers that's watching now make sure you let me know all the texas spots you got because i just this is like i won't be in cali too much longer well i mean i'm always being cali but not like i not like i'm gonna be in texas so shot give me all the spots in texas you guys know of drop them in the comments below and trust me i'm gonna go people so uh yeah let's keep this rolling let's have start this year off great people and Thanks for watching. Thanks for subscribing. Make sure you like and subscribe if you haven't already. And until next year, people, deuces.